Hey, what is going on, you guys? My name is Gambit. Today, we are here with another sneak peek, a really awesome sneak peek. And guys, if you didn't see the sneak peek that came out yesterday, I'll link it down in the description if you want to check that out. And also, I will be streaming on Twitch probably about an hour after this goes live, maybe a little bit before. If you want to come hang out, um, you want to say what's up, there's the link. Um, and it'll be the first link down in the description below if you want to come check it out. But anyway, we have sneak peeks. Today's sneak peek. Is all about clans and this one is a good one guys I'm sure you're all gonna love this so let's go ahead and get through this all right first thing we have here new clan features new friendly war sizes 35 v 35 and 45 v 45 we already had this in the game I'm not sure um, they took it out to help with the the war matchmaking system so now it's back in the game I'm not sure if it's that big of a deal maybe there's a lot of clans out there who wanted it um, so we'll see. That might help with leagues as well. Um, spectator slots for clan wars increased from 20 to 30. I didn't even know there was a limit. I, I didn't. I don't think I've ever heard of anybody not be like not being able to spectate a war match because there's too many. Um, so it's going from 20 to 30, and your friends can now view your attacks, so they can watch your war attacks just from your friends list, which is freaking insane. I love it. Um, it says. Also, this one is good for me as a content creator. It says, get notified when a war attack is occurring, even if you're in replay mode. For me, whenever I'm streaming or I'm making a war video and I, I want to watch you know, live attacks because it's more interesting, then I'm watching a replay just to pass the time and then a live attack's going on. I get out of the replay. It's already half over. I missed half the attack. Now I won't be able to do that. That's awesome. I love that. It's just a nice quality improvement for those of us who want to watch live attacks. Um, so moving on you can now set builders base trophies requirements in your clan settings I didn't know this wasn't a thing um, to be honest, but I'm really glad it is because that's that's kind of a basic necessity for a clan to have So I'm really glad they did this um, They added this so moving on to what I think is one of the cooler things in this update It says the new clan badge has been redesigned and it talks about why they're redesigning it and all this kind of stuff but as you can see, there's the old, there's the new. It looks insane. I love it. I love the way it looks. Every time you level up, the clan badge will change. Um, so a little bit of proof of this. You go up to the top here. Here's a level 14 clan, and the badge is very different. Um, so this looks freaking insane. I love it. I think it looks awesome. Um, and I think that would be cool for a clan, you know, to, to build their badge around the border and their level. Because, like, to be honest... This, this bad, this clan flag does not look good with this badge. So, like, you could, like, just change the color up a little bit or something. I don't know. It's up to the clans if they really want to do that. But that still looks really cool. I think it looks really awesome. So, um, moving on to one of the coolest things of this update visually and stuff like that. We have donation troops. Well, now, march to war and battle unknown VIA, the clan path. So, we now have the clan path guys look at this thing it's awesome this little dirt patch over here to the right has been in the game forever and they've never had a use for it and i don't know why it's even in the game why why they even did this but now they're going to go ahead and move it and they're going to make it the clan path so clan war troops will march the war and here's what i'm hoping this wall will uh, i hope this wall will upgrade as your clan does so it doesn't look that crappy forever so like maybe if you're a level 15 clan it'll be like really cool looking i could i don't even know what a level 15 wall would look like but i hope it's sick i hope it's awesome um so that's just you know it's just something cool that they kind of change because right now all the troops just like run into the ocean and drown i think uh, that's my thing all right social impro improvements excuse me okay so clan suggestions this one is really cool if you guys want to give that a read i'm not going to read it. i'm just going to say what it says um it says uh the basically when you go to go to find a new clan you see clan suggestions and it's always just full of clans with like full of like level fives or level tens who are really bad at the game or they have no idea how to play uh, and you just cannot find a clan there it's just cancer you, you got, your only luck is to go to global or go to the forums to be honest and those are both pretty bad too so hopefully this will help fix it so where actual good clans will come up and then there's parameters you could set so you could set them to 
war often and that's actually how much they're warring not just what their clan says and then you could do it to see how much donations they have so if you're looking for an active clan you could put the donations pretty high you could put the war rate pretty high um, and stuff like that and now your clans the clans that pop up some of them will be your friends clans and if your friends clan is in there and you look at the members list your friend will be highlighted which is just something cool um, I don't think that's a big deal but that's just cool you know to scroll down and like see your friends name highlighted uh, so hopefully that doesn't happen all the time because if I scroll through my my clans list there's gonna be like half the clan highlighted so that's gonna be pretty goofy um, but moving on to clan chat the clan chat tab will now show how many clan mates are currently online now this is something Clash Royale has and ever since then a lot of people in Clash of Clans kind of wanted it so now they're bringing it to it and it's very cool and now nobody could be like oh there's no one online to donate and now you realize there's just 12 people who just don't want to donate to you <laughs> uh, but yeah I'm really excited about that I mean it's just gonna be cool information to know you know it's like stats you never knew um, now moving on the friends list your friends list will um, your friends list will detonate who is online so now your friends list will have that same feature which is pretty cool um it's not a big deal um, unless you like want a friendly battle can you friendly battle a friend hopefully they'll bring that pretty soon that'd be a, that would be sick actually um you can also spectate attacks from your friends via the friends list so that's pretty cool as well that's why now you can like watch your friends war uh matches and stuff like that so if this is anything like clash royale which it's a lot like um if i'm gonna get Lots of friends now on COC. If you guys want to add me, feel free to. You guys know my clan is Too Swift T-shirt. You can add me. Um, I just might get rid of friends every once in a while because you only can have like 20 friends. That's really not enough. Um, I, I fill my friends list every like every week. Um, to be honest. So hopefully we could go ahead and change that a little bit. They they should add more friends. I need more friends. Okay. All right. Now moving on. Oh, 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 that's it. This is like, I'm like, what is this like little cat thing? Uh, but yeah, that's going to be the update, guys. That's sneak peek number two. Sneak peek number one was equally as cool. I think this one, I don't know, this one was pretty awesome. I really like it. Hopefully you guys did. If you want to leave me some suggestions, um, like what do you think about this update? Did you like it? Did you like the sneak peek? Did you like yesterday's sneak peek? I know a lot of you guys said you did. Um, let me know because this is going to be an all levels update. Now here's what I'm predicting for the rest of this update, okay? I think the next um, sneak peek-ish, somewhere around there, is going to be either new, I'm trying to think, what's what's something they can have? I'm going to say, I'm going to go with new trap, because we haven't had a new trap in a while. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to guess new trap, why not? I don't know what it would be, but I've seen a couple like stuff on the forums of cool new trap ideas. And usually when they hang out a long enough time, the Supercell adds something like it in the game. And this trap is pretty cool. So we'll see. We'll see. Um, so that's going to be my prediction. Let me know what you think tomorrow's sneak peek is going to be about. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, homies.